Okay, um, so Quest had his first puppy socialization class today. I gave him a chance to recover, and now we're going to work on a little training session. Now, uh, one of the things I got Quest to do was to help me rehabilitate, well, the primary reason I wanted a dog, but uh, I also wanted to get a dog that could help me rehabilitate other dogs. And uh, there's a great book out there called Calming Signals. The author's name, I believe it's pronounced Turd Ragaz. Uh, probably a saying her last name wrong, and I apologize if she's ever watching this. It's a great book. It, it basically talks about how she discovered how her dog would give certain body language communications to other dogs to help them calm down or help them feel more comfortable. She calls them calming signals. So uh, dogs get calming signals on their own, but I want to be able to trigger a key a calming signal out of him later on when he gets an adult. Now, calming signals can include turning your head to the side and yawning, uh, raising up your paw like you're pointing, scratching at the dirt. There's a lot more in the book. If, you, I, I, if you're interested in dog behavior, I'd recommend it. It's an easy read and it's really informative. Um, I'm gonna work on him raising his paw right now. So I've got a bunch of high body training treats. Um, I'm gonna basically put him into a sit and every, every time he raises his paw like he just did, I'm gonna treat him and I assign the command word of wrist. So let's see how this goes. Sit, wrist. I'm going to lure him back over here, wrist, sit, wrist. Now sit, wrist. I would prefer that he didn't put his paw on me, but at this stage of training, I, he's been doing this for all of five minutes, wrist. So when you start training a dog for a new behavior, you want to just reward wrist. Even the close, even the, you want to break it down individual steps and uh, to worry about finishing and finalizing it, wrist, later on. Wrist. Wrist. Let's get over here and give you a good camera angle. Wrist. Wrist. So I'm not worried about him using both paws or jumping up on me at this stage. We'll refine the technique as we go, but uh, being able to tell him wrist and have him go like this is gonna be beneficial if I have a dog that's reactive and I can get him to do that. Nine weeks old, dogs are amazing. So this is a quick little video on how to teach your dog to, uh, or at least the first part of teaching your dog to start pulling up his paw as a calming signal. Right, Quest? That's right.